This is still kind of fucked, but I'm back. I'm back playing Pokemans, as always. Didn't really know what to play today, uh, but I was in the middle of shiny hunting Cyndaquil, so I figured we'd continue doing that. Um, there was things that I didn't prepare, and I will do that now. Oh my god, trick. Thank you so much for the sub. You didn't have to do that. I'm about to sub. I'm about to sub. <laughs> so loud. Let's see here. I need a timer for our eggs. Egg. And right before I started, my eyes started itchy. 
And then also, I don't know if anybody has glasses and wears headphones like these. It almost is impossible to feel comfortable. Okay, there we go. We need a timer. There it is. Drag it over here. Why am I eye itchy? What the fuck? Uh, we need a 30 minute timer. Shush. Why are you shushing people today? Shushing me, shushing Dave. Can't believe this. Window capture? No, we don't need a window capture of that one. We need a window capture of that one. There's got to be like a cleaner way to do this, but honestly, this works pretty well. Every time I have done it, I have muted it this time. I always forget to mute it. I don't know where we want to put it. Fuck okay, it, we'll put it here. Anyway, um, I didn't start it because I it was the first time I opened up my my switch since I did this, but I I bought the game. So prepare for fucking that next week. I'm going to play so much Zelda. Uh, when Zelda one came out, I wasn't streaming, so I don't think I ever streamed Zelda. Um, we could have gone through it. I was going through hard mode with normal Zelda. I don't know. Should we play Zelda? I already fucking put that I'm playing Pokemon. Zelda 1? Yeah, Zelda Breath of the Wild. Breh. I never, I don't think I ever streamed Breath of the Wild. It could be fun. So I was doing hard mode. It's been a while, so could could be slightly fresh. Well, everyone and their mother is playing like Zelda Breath of the Wild right now um, because of anticipation of Zelda. I'm hot, taking this jacket off. What up, Floop? How's it going? I actually had a question for you and I don't remember what it was. It was Gundam related. Boob of the Wild? Breast of the Wild? Man, both of y'all are yellow. One of y'all gotta change y'all's color. Questions? Yeah, I forgot what it was. Me and uh, Shrek here were talking about the Gundams. It was something. I don't remember. Fuck. This really would be like a hard pivot if I did change this. I kind of here, like, let's see. Oh, I could do it on my other profile, so I don't have to fuck with this one. But then again, my other profile doesn't have the DLC on it. I don't want to overwrite. Play in normal mode. No. See, like, I was already playing in hard mode. Why am I on this? Is this better? Yeah, you purple now. No blue. What do you mean, no blue? I was playing in hard mode or master mode or whatever it's called um and i picked blue uh well it's showing up purple on the like chat screen but showing up blue on the 
actual chat. So I don't know why it does that. Like I've noticed the same thing happens with so in the DLC you get this mask where like people will ignore you. Um which is nice. Here hold on, it's popping. Boob of the whore. Bleh. Um I think it's kind of like cheating though. <laughs> I don't even remember how to play this goddamn game. World. Ten minute timeout. Of what? Oh, of Shrek. There's no mods here. I think, I don't even know. If, no, Shrek's not a mod. Never see me again. Great. Great, dude. Damn, dude, I was pretty far. Look at my fucking hearts. Why do I have that many hearts? It's because I was doing hard mode? Interesting. Master sword? Um, <clears throat> I didn't do the master sword thing yet, I don't think, at that point. Maybe we'll do that Thursday. For anticipation of the game. I already did a whole thing and yeah. Jumping back to the regular schedule. Heroes tomorrow, I get paid tomorrow. Yeah, we're going to Heroes. I was gonna see if you and Dave wanted to go watch Guardians as well. What the hell's happening? Well, now I'm like stuck on Zelda controls. So I was trying to jump. All right. So I was trying to get a shiny Cyndaquil. <clears throat> I just washed it. Great. Great. But so what? Great, dude. I want to see it. Uh... Um, In Japan, you know, <laughs> I went to Japan, by the way. Um, if you went to the Pokemon Center, they're doing a, a, a special distribution that's only in Japan. I wish it wasn't a Pikachu, but whatever, it's pretty cool. Um, but I got this cool Japanese Pikachu um, that knows Celebrate. Here, you can see it. And it knows Present, and it's holding, I forgot, I think it's Thunder Wave that it's holding. Um, but it also has a special mark on it, the uh, Premier Ribbon. Uh, the celebratory so it's Japanese and look it even says that it came from a Pokemon Center, which is very cool Great movie you'll like it. I know I will I'm so excited about it. Uh, I just don't want to have anything spoiled and Catching up on shit like tonight. We're gonna watch Mandalorian the last two episodes that we need to catch up on and So and I really want to see Guardians Guardians has always been one of my favorites. So I Figured it might be a good time to do that but um, I was doing a little bit of Cyndaquil hunting. Obviously, I didn't have a lot of time that I was doing this uh, while, you know, abroad. Uh, but I did do some. <clears throat> so we're going to finish up this batch um, and then continue hunting here. So really nothing crazy besides just chilling. Um, looking for rando shinies while we're hunting so I was going up and down here because I really want to skidoo I've also been chilling in the desert because I want to poop boy I always felt that they were the best music wise um, of course their music is amazing and they were the first ones to do it 
Ragnarok had really cool music, but we don't talk about the fourth Thor film. Um, Ragnarok's still so good. But yeah, Guardians overall, like even, like I like the Iron Man trilogy, but even with just the first two Guardians, um, I thought was the strongest like contender of a series because um, Guardians 1 is very good. The only thing that's, it's not like annoying, but slightly annoying is the having to put the team together kind of thing. Like, but of course, every first movie's got to do that, like introducing every character. And that's why I like Guardians 2 so much. And I, I don't know the consensus on Guardians 2, like if people love it or not, but I, I love Guardians 2 um, because all the characters are established and it's just expanding on the fact of the characters. So having um, essentially the like end um, is probably going to be really emotional and all that. Come on, first egg is shiny because I, you know, I faked it. I made sure it's shiny, saved beforehand and then started streaming. Ready? Nope, no shiny. But yeah, I have both Guardians of the Galaxy albums on vinyl. So I will have to get the third one whenever they do that. I'm excited to see the music as well because of the implications of him not having a tape deck anymore. His little Walkman. I feel the same with Batman or Spider-Man. I've seen Uncle Ben die and his parents die 30 times now. Yeah. Yeah, that's why it was cool what they did with... Um, no way home or whatever like they did it but put a spin on it to make it new and especially with the whole like different multiverse or whatever it made sense like of course there would be differences batman the new batman they like it's year one or whatever so that's pretty cool that it's already like established we don't really need to see it you can like hint at it and stuff which works all the same right Like, I understand that argument, but I also get upset about that argument because it's the whole... I don't get upset, but, like, I understand the reason why they're doing it. It's such a pivot. It's the whole reason why they're superheroes. <laughs> like, so it makes sense why they have to do it or have to, but there's different ways to go about it, right? My camera kind of stuttery fixing that right now. What if that was the shiny one and I didn't see it? It working? It working? You a little bit cleaner now? I don't know if it's best to keep it open. Eh, it's, it's doing better. It's doing better with it open. I like already established world and show don't tell kind of thing. Yeah, exactly. Like we don't need a whole first 30 minute arc of that happening, but it being mentioned or gone over doesn't bother me. It just really depends on execution. So we in the same boat there. All right, so we want down attack up speed like that one Ooh -wee. Uh, but we want it in a pokeball like we want timid looks like all the great ball ones are doing it i know we got a perfect parent for the great ball but we actually want two cyndaquils we want one in a pokeball and one in a great ball so i think right now we have a really good parent for Okay, so this one has four IVs, which is pretty good. This one only has three. Modest is also like a secondary nature that we might be looking at.
Here, let's compare this one to the one that we already have as a parent. Yeah. All right. We're gonna have to breed a parent with the right nature for our Pokeball Cyndaquil, and then we'll be good to go. And then we can just start pumping out eggs. My thing stuttery. Why are you stuttery? Come on, camera. Also, I can't get my fucking GoPro to work, which is pissing me off. And I've kind of given up on it right now, but eventually you'll see my dumb little face in 4K. Actually, it won't be 4K because it spits it out on Twitch as 1080, but um, it should look better. Definitely card cam will look better. Um, I just need to get it. I, it's all kinds of fucky, apparently. Also, next weekend when fucking Breath of the Wild comes out, or Breath of the Wild, Tears of the Kingdom comes out, um, they're doing another Unrivaled thing. So I, I, I probably won't stream it, um, but I gotta catch that. They're doing, I forgot who they're doing. They're doing Chestnut, which means they'll do Delphox. Which is pretty cool. Because Delphox has a great shiny. Also to avoid spoilers, just avoid socials besides DMs because I know one scene has been getting some popularity. Damn. Well, that's why I want to watch it tomorrow. Like, I just want to be able to see it immediately. And honestly, I haven't gotten any, like, anything crazy with the whole Guardians thing, so. Um, but when, how long has it been out? When did it come out? Last Friday? Last Thursday yeah so it's been out for a bit so I'm pretty surprised that I haven't like seen anything really so um, if I watch it tomorrow I should be good If not, I might pick a day after work and go watch it. And it's the end of a trilogy? Exactly, yeah. So. And like I was saying, arguably my favorite trilogy. Because Iron Man seems more than just a trilogy, so. Like Iron Man 3 is not the end of Iron Man's story, so it almost doesn't feel like a trilogy. Same thing with all the other ones. Like, Endgame is the end of the main... Uh, like the... I don't know. Trilogies. Thor just has no end <laughs> at all right now.
<clears throat> uh, have you seen the Christmas special? It's important to the lore. Yeah, I've, I've watched that Christmas special. I know what they did, which is pretty cool. It also makes sense, like, when you think about it, you're like, oh. Yeah, it was cute. It wasn't anything crazy. We, I think we watched it like on Christmas or like Christmas Eve or something. Like I meant to watch it beforehand and then it just ended up being like smack dag on the day. Smack dag? Is that what I said? Smack dab? There you go. On the day. Goat. I want a shiny goat, dude. Or a little grasshopper. I love Nimble. He's so cool. Even though I already have a low kick, so I'd like a Nimble. Also, home needs to come out. Watch it come out like peak fucking Zelda shit. It probably will. Song is making the egg hatching so intense. Ah, rock, rock dog. I always liked Cyndaquil a lot. His design was so cool. But I don't like how they deflamed him. He should have his fire always out. Except for like when he's like sleeping. drawing Cyndaquil all the time as a kid. I guess Sun and Moon was the last time I had a possibility of like shiny hunting him, but shiny hunting in Sun and Moon was hard. <laughs> Holy shit. This one's very good, even though it needs special attack but not the right nature at all. I wonder if I can search with, uh, like through the boxes by nature. I think that's something that we were able to do before. So we'll just double check that we have the best parents and then we'll start hunting. I want a goat, dude. Or a mudbray. I've, I've never had a shiny mudbray.
Here, let's go in the desert. So I want a sand dial or I want a poop bug. A little poop boy. Of course, Rufflet. Of course. Just muted and unmuted the mic like eight times. I'm an idiot. Oh no. <laughs> Look at him. Look at him under there. This one. This is the shiny. This is it. We know it is. Nope. Damn. Damn. Okay. I believe this is the last row. Ooh, another timid. Ooh, and a female. That's pretty good. Another timid, wow. Okay, I think at this point I was using the correct parent because all the great balls are in timid. Um, which is good. So after this, we'll breed a timid Pokeball Cyndaquil and then breed both of them. One of these just be rolling a gold nugget. That's all. That's all. That's all I'm asking for. That's all I'm asking for. No big deal. The only thing that's like shiny here that doesn't stand out would be the like silicobra. I think it's just like more yellow. So unless it's near another silicobra, I probably won't know it's shiny. I think also that Bramblin Pokemon. Is it Bramblin? Is it really called that? Uh, or am I getting that confused? But the Bramble Pokemon or whatever. Um, I think it's just really muted, like gray. 
So that might be a tough one to spot as well. more God damn, ruffle it. New idea, next time you go on vacation, you could just put on a playlist of your VODs going until you return. Um, yeah, I know uh, a lot of people have done that, but usually it's like bigger Twitch streamers. I was just kind of worried about my computer exploding while I was gone. Um, I had an idea of flipping the camera <clears throat> and like having like a K cam. K would have company. <laughs> you wouldn't be able to hear it, I don't think. But yeah, I, I thought about stuff like that. We had, um, obviously somebody like look after the house and stuff like that. So I thought it'd be weird if there was like a fucking camera going, I don't know. Like if I would have done the, the VOD thing, that would have been cool. I probably would have had enough time, honestly. I don't know how I would do that though. Like that's a, I don't, yeah, I don't know how I would have gone about that. Hmm. Okay, like, let's see if we can search by, we can. Timid. Let's just do Cyndaquil. Oh, you can't search Cyndaquil because it's not in the decks. Okay. Okay, so that one's timid. Let's get all the timid boys together. Wow, there's a lot of them there. I think that's where it started. Like after I got my first one. YouTube playlist, that's what I was thinking, honestly. Um, like if you were to put all the things in playlist then you just like screen record YouTube, I guess, and then just let it go down the line. Honestly, it'd be pretty interesting to watch like from start to finish, like of like the, cause you'd be able to see the progression of the stream because there's been a lot of iterations next month is my two-year anniversary and i'm kind of starting to plan that um i don't know what i'm gonna do um because i want it to be like a big thing but I, I don't know i don't know what i'm gonna do you know what thinking about it now i need to request that day off 100 percent Okay, so these are all the best boys. Now let's see what natures they have. 
our nature so ivs they have okay so we don't want attack but they're all pretty much going to have attack this one's pretty good because it has special attack because i've noticed a lot of them don't it's got four this one only has three this one only has two this one only has two this one has five which is kind of nuts Three, but in special attacks, pretty good. Three, four, two. This one's got three. Um, three. This one's got four, but one's an attack, so it almost doesn't matter. This one has four. Two, three, one, two. This one's got four. This one's got four. Two, or no, it's three, two, three, uh, four with no good speed. And then we got two and three. So now let's do this. We want, what is it? Female? That's female, right? All right, so we do have a good female one that has four. Okay. So those two top rows are best contender. Set. All right. And then we have the original one that we have. Let's see what they've got. It's pretty good. It's four. All right, I already moved him over, right? Yeah, I did. Okay, so definitely not the best one. This is the best one. It's got five, but I would like it to have special attack because I think the ditto, the reason it's not having special attack is that it it doesn't have it. Um, So possibly, eh, is there any, okay. Wondering if there's any special attack without the attack. It doesn't look like it. So this one, this one's kind of the best one um, because the fact of it having speed in special attack, those are the more important ones. doesn't really matter. We're just going to bottle cap whatever it doesn't get and guaranteed whatever we fucking hatch is only going to have like two IVs because that's how it always goes. I think I've hatched one perfect IV Pokemon like that was shiny. It had everything that it needed, like all the five IVs like one or two ever in my entire like career of fucking hunting Pokemon. All right, but we do have the female, which is good. And if I remember, the female is what passes down the Pokeball. So what we need is a female. Okay. We need female with good IVs, I guess. Fuck. Okay, no, no, no. We need a female to have the Everstone. 
is it will pass down its Pokeball and it will fuck. No, no, no. Okay, no, we need we need the mail because <clears throat> mail for the timid. And then we need a female and a Pokeball because then it'll pass down. Let's see if we can find any here. These are all great balls, great balls. Okay, except for this one. What? The Cyndaquil has got timid. Never mind. This one's in a Pokeball. So we have the two parents. And this one's pretty decent. It's got three. And it's like all things that we would want. How did I miss that? Wow, just slipped through the cracks there, huh? Nice. Okay, well, we have the parents then. Both timid. Boop, 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 boop. So this one's got good IVs. Okay, we want to put away in our bag because we don't want that. Here, let's give him the Everstone. They're also both male, which is great, so they won't mate. Give him the Everstone. Boom. And then our, so our dittos have, nice. Okay, so our dittos have the Destiny Knots and our Cyndaquils have the Everstones because we don't have our ditto decks yet. Dude, it's going to be so insane as soon as home comes out with how crazy I am with Pokemon. Just everything moved over and I don't ever need anything ever again. Actually got, no, no. I have, a, I have a, like this, um, this foreign ditto is just as good as my foreign ditto. And it, even more so, cause this one's got modest nature, which is pretty damn good. Cause I have a five IV ditto as well, I believe. So this thing is actually, do I? Yeah, I think it's five. Cause it's, it's like almost impossible to get a six IV ditto. Um, but I'll have two, which is great, because then technically we only need one more and we can have three five IV dittos because we can breed up to three things in this game. Okay, so we're going to put this ditto up here so it doesn't get confused with anything and then do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Let's do this. Mark them. So it's got best in HP, best in attack, no defense, special attack, and speed. This one has best in speed, defense, and defense. This should go with this one. I don't know if it breeds like this, uh, but that's how we're gonna set it up. Nice. Okay. Should be good to go now. That's awesome. We didn't even have to do the like mid breed thing to pass down the nature. Now, where do we want to hang out? Oh, you know what's something I did wanna do? I did wanna do the um, Maybe we'll do this. Maybe we'll do this right now. Um, since I went to Japan, I got postcards like in Pokemon Go uh, through the gifts or whatever um, from Japan. So I can get the Japanese pavilions, which is pretty cool. I think it was something I already had possibly.
where do we want to breed? I always go here. Got Japanese egg from you? Yeah. Um, I was sending it out to other people. Um, you should save the postcards because, I don't know, just in case you ever want to play this game, you can get a Japanese pavilion. Yeah, I imagine all the like rando friends that I have on there are like, what the fuck? Why am I getting Japanese gifts from this guy in Texas? Yeah, all the eggs that I have right now are all like Japanese. I guess it doesn't it doesn't really matter at all I, I don't know why i'm putting so much weight maybe we'll do it Cheeky save. I hatch at least an egg a day at work. Yeah, that's how I used to be too with uh, me actually doing things at work. I used to be able to hatch it. All right, it's a picnic, baby. Make a sandwich. I'm actually running out of picks, which is ridiculous. Why am I why am I plate so bright? What the fuck? The glare. Gonna set up the timer on my phone real quick. Timer, there it is. Timer. Boom. Start that one too. And now we just chill. Not even his fires come out. What? Damn. Look how cute they are running around. Oh my god, I love them. I almost got a Cyndaquil plushie while I was at the Pokemon Center. Probably just do a batch at a time since it can be kind of boring with the whole 30 minute egg collecting thing.
Um, I have been looking into getting my cards graded. I think I'm going to do that after the two year anniversary because I'm going to do a big card opening. Um, and man, is it expensive. It really do be expensive. Um, I want to do the BGS, which is because um, I really like their slabs and uh, um, it's like $18 a card. The minimum is 10, but I was thinking about doing 25 because there's a lot of stuff that I want to get graded. Um, and I think that would be like a cool chunk. 25 graded cards would be $450. Actually, well, 10 would be 180, right? I don't know. Maybe I will do 10 because that seems like a lot of money, but I, it'd be hard to pick only 10 cards. All right, let's collect the eggs. What? Only one egg? That's not very promising. All right, that was just the first batch though. That was just the first batch. So I at least want to get all of my all arts graded. Um, there are also with like my Charizards too. At least I, I, I at least want to get all my shiny Charizards graded because that's the whole point of me getting into cards. I wanted to get every shiny Pokemon. So that's four. And then there's like a couple of other cards that I was wanting to get graded. I might have to do a little bit more research to see which ones are worth getting graded as far as money wise because it's going to be so much money that if something doesn't really go up in value probably shouldn't get it graded until later oh and then all my like marnie cards i want to get marnie all my marnie cards graded there's one more card I want to get of Marty that I want to buy, but man, is it? It's kind of pricey. The original Marty from the Sword and Shield set. Like right here, I have like. I think it's. I have 22. And there's two cards that I have, <clears throat> like that Misty card I want to get graded, and then that's in the case already. I was thinking that I wouldn't get it graded and that's why I put it in that case, but then I was like, fuck it, it's like the only one I'll probably get. And why not? It's still probably appreciate in value no matter what grade it is. Um And then that Marnie cards, so that's already two, so really I only have one extra slot. Um and then I was gonna wait until after my anniversary stream, because I plan on getting a whole bunch of cards and hopefully we pull some crazy shit that we'd want to get graded, so. And really out of this batch, there's only two cards that I could say, like, probably could wait. But they're cards that I like. Which are the Aroma Lady and my Dark Magician Girl. Just because I love those cards so much, it'd be cool to slap them up. But who knows? We'll see. We'll see. Then all the other potential cards to get graded is this fucking stack. <laughs> okay, this is a better batch for sure. Cool. That instills confidence.
Oops. I also ordered a card for my Gardevoir deck. That's very, very good. Um, speaking of, there's... A uh, fucking card list that I really liked. Yeah, I'll probably go with this list, honestly. It's very good. It's very good. My sleepy Cyndaquil. Wake up, Cyndaquil. Go play with your friend. I want to play with the ball. I can play with the ball. Look how he runs. Oh my god. <laughs> Good try, bud. What I miss, um, me hatching some of the eggs that I had left over. And this is our first little batch here. We're only 10 minutes in um, to the first official batch. We got both of our Cyndaquils of different Pokeballs with the correct nature. So now it's just egg hatching time. I was also talking about um, me setting up to get my cards graded and how expensive it is and how I'm going to do it after our second anniversary, which is next month. Oh. Hit the mic. And I've been like saying I was going to get it graded and get graded, but like I really want to do it soon. So it's just a lot of money. There's a couple things that I'm trying to take care of beforehand, uh, but right around that time should be where I have some open funds to spend on something like that. Getting 25 cards graded would be $450 is what I was explaining. So it's $18 a card. The minimum is 10 and that would be nice to do, but I have a decent amount of cards that I would like to get graded. So I kind of want to do a big batch, big batch 25. Um, and then maybe periodically do the 10. This 10 would only be 180 bucks. Gonna have to get a graded card case as well. Yeah, I found one on Amazon that I really like and it's like 75 bucks. So yeah, I was already like thinking about it as being another expense. I was gonna buy that, like the check before I spend on grading it. So I have it and then send my cards to get in graded. And then they'll come back in like 60 days or some shit, which sucks. Um, but then I'll have it and I'll be able to store it. And also, that'd be a very cool stream to do, too. It'd be like a grading card reveal. See what we got, especially with with this bad boy right here, because we got this guy on stream. My Charizard, my first official chase card to see what that gets as a grade is going to be very exciting, I think, for like me and the stream because that was that was a moment man that was a moment here
Yeah, buy the cabinet first as motivation. Yeah, hell yeah. I'm also um, trying to like put together some plans on building like a like a dresser of sorts, some type of cabinet for all of my cards. I mean, that's also another thing. Um, getting some things put together to gear up to having more space and like a dedicated stream room. So uh, the green screen will probably go away in a couple of months. Maybe, uh, I think I might make it where it can be an option where I can always put it up if I want. But I do dig the style of having uh, the room. It's just the fact of me having so many things crammed into one room. So you have to stare at it until you send them in. Yeah. Yeah, it's like 75 bucks on something that you don't even like use <laughs> or like properly, I guess. Yeah, pretty much on the same page of the whole like making myself do it by getting the the case. My camera being stupid again. All right, we got fixed it. Yeah, it's good. I'll give y'all's ball back here. Stop getting it stuck by trying to bean me in the face, assholes. Y'all always do this. Play with the ball over here. About halfway through the batch. I didn't mean to do that. I wonder if like bathing your Pokemon and stuff I don't even know how I do it. A wash? I wonder if that... I got selected for a different apartment. No more members slash customers for this guy. Fuck yeah. That's awesome. Plus a raise? Nice. Nice. Watch this ditto. Gross. Lubber. I wonder if it matters how much you wash them. Like, how much scrubbing you do? Pretty psyched. Yeah, I would be. I'm I'm so tired of dealing with people. My uh, <clears throat> my vacation helped, but man, do I still fucking hate it. which Cyndaquil I bathed. Yeah, 
It's stupid that you can throw out the ball, but you can't fucking like put it away. I wonder if there is an option. Like once you throw it out, like it's fucking, it's just chaos. That's why sometimes I don't even do it because I don't want them, it's like annoying me with this fucking ball. There's so many things with the picnic thing that like doesn't make any fucking sense. Why doesn't it have the timer of the sandwiches? You're, yeah, it's the whole point of the picnic. Why can't you go into like your box menu? Why can't you fucking pick up the ball? So dumb. I don't like shitting on this game because everybody does, but there are definitely some things that they should have fixed or should be different for sure. What is my little little feats? Looking at the decal on these little footprints. I don't think you can get a different lamp. But I did customize all the picnic stuff to look like the most bog standard picnic you could ever get. Basically will be a help slash verification line for agents. So we shall see how it goes. Yeah. Um, that's a position that I definitely could probably like on like the equivalent on my end. Um, it's like being a lead or whatever. I probably could get it, but you have to work in office to do that. So it would actually be a pay cut for me. And so I was like, no, no, not doing that. Uh, Cause I'd have to work in office, which sucks. But that's like what our leads kind of do is like when the agents need help. Yeah, never office ever again. Yeah, dude. It's fucking sucks. It's stupid. And my fucking job is like, like wishy washy about it. Like only the best people can work from home. And also since you're working from home, you get more responsibilities. And they're like, you get in more trouble if you like call in and stuff like that. And it's like, oh, fuck off. And I'm convinced we're on a different queue than normal people. But no, apparently not, no. Like I should be able to pick up the ball. It does not let me. That's me re-throwing the ball out. Okay, so I have a whistle. No. Okay, I can take pictures. Which I want to do. I want a better picture as like my background stuff. Pretty sure they got rid of my office, only the main one left in another state, so I like that. Yeah, that's what they should, like, ever, like, that's the thing that fucking COVID proved, is that you don't need a brick and mortar, you're just wasting money. Like, I don't understand why, like, my job and other ones that are like that don't embrace that fact. Uh, studies say people are happier working from home, so, like, why the fuck would you just have an office anyway, just to, like, pay the rent and the lights and all that kind of shit when they can just work from home. It's so dumb. It's so dumb. My job is so dumb. It's, it's really for higher ups to be there like in an office in the office and look out at all the people and be like, wow, look at all these people that are working for me. Like that's how I live. That's how I legitimately feel like that's why they still have an office is just to be like 
I have a better office in this office and look at all the other people under me. Like, what other reason would you do that for? Oh, some people work like shit when they work from home. Fire them. Fire them. Hire someone else that doesn't work like shit from home. Sucks for changing out equipment though. Have to get shit shipped. Yeah, like you can have an office like for like stuff like that, but why are you requiring like the 90% of people to be in the office when everyone can work from home? You could have a smaller office for like basically those things. To like swap out equipment or like IT and shit. Like, I don't know. And usually stuff like that doesn't happen very often. So if you don't have like shit equipment, you should be perfectly fine. Even if you did have to ship it, like shouldn't happen all the time. Yeah, it's a waste holding on to old ways of doing things. Yeah, dude. You can't slap the secretary's ass on the way around and light up your cigarette and whiskey in your office if everyone works from home. Why my camera be doing this all the time? My camera is freaking out. Give me a sec. Hopefully this does not crash the stream. I'm still here. My face isn't though. Will in just a sec. There it is. There I am. It's freaking out because I'm starting the thing up. Don't worry. Don't worry. There it is. That it is. All right. After this little three minute batch, the next batch will be our last one. So, and then we start hatching. Get us a shiny boy. It'd be kind of cool if we got a boy and a girl. I would want the Hisuian one as a girl because it looks like they have eyeliner on. Ah, Pokemon, or not Pokeball. I also got my ball as a yarn ball because the first Pokemon that we shiny hunted as an eggs was Sprigatito. It's a reason for everything, guys. It's a reason for everything. That's how anxious and controlling I need to not be anxious. Everything has a place. Everything has a reason. Don't do anything without calculating. Actually, I do some things without calculating, but we don't talk about those things. Okay? Don't talk about it. All right? Most things are methodical. I'm like a serial killer without the drive. Like a serial killer with conscience. Don't kill anybody. But plan everything as if a big, long... I don't know where this bit is going. <laughs> it's going to be taken out of context. It's Trevor's on one saying how he's a serial killer, but doesn't kill people. That just makes me sound like a sociopath or something. I'm not that far, okay? Just with my stuff. My stuff, everything has a place. If anybody knows what nulling is, my whole life is nulling. He's morals, guys. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> All right, last one. That didn't give me a lot of eggs for some reason.
Oh, the Deoxys fight. Holy shit. I was like, what is it? Deoxys fight. Crazy. Crazy, boy. BRB. Flip, I didn't even know you were still here, bro. Shout out to Floop. He just graduated high school. Stocks you, bro. Oh, yeah. Last little batch here. I was cleaning and building. Oh, God. You know you're not supposed to use your graduation money for Gundams, right? I guess you can technically use it for whatever you fucking want, but I've probably done the same. Every child is a serial killer in a tiny body. If they had adult strength, no one would survive. <laughs> he said, I have not, uh, dude. I haven't spent it all, dude. Last minute here. Both of y'all, I got both y'all at the same place. We need to figure out what fucking uh, decks y'all are wanting to build, man. So y'all can come out and uh, go to locals with me, dude. I want to get back into it. I want to get like so into it that I'm going to fucking regionals and flying to other places. Man, at least the Texas ones, man. Like, that'd be sick. Do the TCG. I'm gonna go back to Japan on a paid flight, motherfuckers. As a TCG champion. I wanna do that. I wanna do it. I gotta put more work in. But I want my boys with me. David, too. David already knows what deck he wants. I just don't know if he's fucking ordered it or not. It sounded like he was going to, but I guarantee you he did not order it. Guaranteed. So kind of one prize stall deck. Um, dude, if we would have known, like if I would have been more in the TCG thing, we would have built you uh, the Reggie deck. That deck was nuts. Um, oh, it's over. Okay, cool. Um, but now that kind of, it might come back, but a lot of it got fucking hit because of the rotation. Apparently, it's based on like you needing a whole bunch of special energies and like post rotation all the ones that they used were like no longer a thing uh, So it pretty much died Oh man, we we're supposed to start another sandwich so we can have quicker eggs, but whatever But I am cute like uh oh forgot to do this I'm wondering if there is one that we can do. One prize, you know what's interesting is Valhalla, I don't know if you'll still have that same sentiment with this type of um, format that we're in because we're not we're no longer in like V and V max format We're in EX's which have to evolve. So like it still has um, The same style as like a one prize. It's just your final evolution is a two prize But it's it's stronger. So it's not as like V's was kind of like turbo. I, I Don't know how to like describe it like V's is like I don't know why this analogy is the analogy that's coming to me, but like V format and V max stuff was like SWAT. EX's is like a normal Slayer match. And then like one prize decks that are like OG one prize deck is so slow that it's kind of like big team battle. I don't even know if that analogy works, but that's, that's the one I've said and that's the one I'm sticking to it.
like so i think you might you you won't harbor that same mentality against it because i understand that it was like almost too quick with these and scent and stuff um uh but like this ex format is kind of like a i actually really dig it because it's since i came from the v's me first getting into pokemon like tcg like for real um it seems like a very good middle ground makes sense to me i know you would get it i'm just saying i think i might sound like a crazy person to other people All right, let's do this. Let's start hatching, boys. I'm I'm hoping it looked like it was a decent. Let's see how many. How much did we actually get? Yeah, right over, right over two. Let's see if it's a good split. It's looking like a good split. A lot of Pokeballs, honestly. Which, but it's kind of good because beforehand we were kind of great ball heavy. So, looks like we got a good split of our parents there. So, let's go for it. You love me some SWAT though, just not with cards. Yeah, dude, SWAT was my jam. We all know this, and you know this, and you know this. All right, let's start hatching. Okay, we'll get rid of the timer just so it's clean. <laughs> and, you, and you know what? To just uh, complete this analogy, fucking expanded format is just like grab bag or griff ball. <laughs> it just doesn't make no fucking sense. Why are you playing it? <laughs> who plays fucking expanded expanded's like the most crazy thing ever like that's essentially it's called an eternal format or something like that uh, that's essentially what Yu-Gi-Oh is because it's got like a ban list and shit which going from Pokemon even though it's kind of a bummer when your deck gets like destroyed um, but going going to a game that has a rotation like this does like that's why Yu-Gi-Oh is so fucking crazy is because of how you can technically use every card ever existed so all the broken shit is still there if it's not banned and like if it's banned that means it was broken right but then as soon as you release more cards you can find a card from like 10 years ago and be like oh this is broken now is Halo Infinite still going strong I still see merch brand deal promotions Halo Infinite apparently is in like the shitter uh, because they're like they didn't like support it correctly like how they went about multiplayer was like really bad and we kind of saw that even when I was playing it like why were there only five maps why were there only like two fucking game modes that you couldn't choose from like you just had to hopefully get it like they did a whole bunch of shit that like was dumb and then also on top of that having like a season pass model like fortnite or something i think it just pissed everybody off so like no one plays it almost bought sour gummies because they were halo like i still love halo to death and like i don't know it seems like like Pokemon's doing okay, even though people have like gripes with this. This game still sold like incredibly well. Um, I'm hoping that they're going to fix it, especially by the DLC. And this game will be a different game by the time the DLCs are out. It's just like Sword and Shield. Um, but man, I, I want, I want like a golden age for gamers and the uh, uh, for the franchises that I love. Like, they need a like out of the park home run game for both of these things. Arceus honestly captured a lot of people. Um, Legends Arceus, they captured a lot of people and everybody was talking about it. Everybody was having fun playing it. 
um, if back when Arceus was out, I was just like, just wait for this type of style of mechanic with actual battle mechanics, and I would have like been in love with it. Is that shiny? I don't think that's shiny, is it? No, it's green. Now, yeah, good thing about nowadays is I can fix and add stuff, yeah. That's what I'm hoping for, like, with this. I think when Home comes out, they're gonna, like, secretly put a whole bunch of updates. What the hell? Uh, they're gonna secretly put a whole bunch of updates in it to fix certain things. Also, I think the reason why this game, like, is not good or whatever, like, graphics-wise and everything like that, um, is because... You're working off of seven year old system. Like we should have a, we should have a switch two already. Like it's, it's, it's pretty old fucking hardware. Even when the switch came out, the like chips that were in it were old. So like, and, and there were like rumors and like plans for like a switch pro essentially which would like have better graphics and like be able to play in 4k when docked and stuff like that and then they just didn't do it and they released the oled switch so like i really hope the next console from nintendo because i think honestly the switch is a perfect console but nintendo likes to do fucking wild shit i really hope they just fucking make a souped up switch don't change anything, please. <laughs> Maybe the drift. Fix that. Don't you see that I have barely played mine? But it can be the girls. Exactly. Yeah. I know. I just bought an OLED. So, like, if they release a fucking... The next Switch next year, it's gonna kind of hurt. I just bought an OLED. Uh, but... It's really nice, and I love it. And the reason I got it is because of this game. And then now so even more for Zelda. I played my my original Switch for so many years and had so many hours on it. So I was like, I'm afraid this is going to die. So that's why I got an OLED. Dibs. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't know. It really depends on what the next console is, is if I would get rid of this or not. I I, I dig the... Um, this this switch for sure i still want to put a sticker on the front of my my oled dock and i don't know who to put on there because i got some pokemon stickers from the pokemon center i think i was i think i was gonna put porygon on it i think that's pretty cool and fitting i think a switch pro makes sense yeah so do i I just want them to do it. I just don't think it's going to... I don't even think it's going to be next year. I, I'm really hoping it's next year, like holiday next year. The reason why I'm thinking it's not going to be next year is because they're going to try to milk this Zelda game for a while. Like sell as many fucking consoles as they possibly can sell because of Zelda, all that kind of stuff, and then roll out a new Switch once the Zelda like starts to decline in sales. Just trying to figure out where to put my Bulbasaur. Yeah, dude. I love those stickers so much, but since they're like... Stickers are so permanent that like... Not like the fact of like whatever I put it on, I'm going to be bummed out that it's on there. It's the fact that like I only have one chance to use this sticker. <laughs> like that I don't... I, it always hard. Unless Zelda sucks because of old tech. I think I've heard some rumors that there was a little bit of like scuff with it and uh yeah that would make sense too though right like if they fucking unveiled zelda it starts to decline because of performance issues if they released the new switch like this holiday and like you could still play switch games on it or whatever it would just soup shit up it would fix this game and zelda whatever zelda's problems have force them to upgrade yeah that would be honestly nice even though that would suck all donkey dick because it'd be like this game like this game had problems and it still has problems and being so excited about playing the game and then it having problems 
obviously is a bummer and takes away from some of the experience of the of you playing the game uh, this game besides like performance stuff they made some choices that i'm not like that took away from it a little bit as well besides just it running not the best like if it did i think i might be able to overlook some things but like the fact of you being able to get shinies so easily it's always a bummer for a shiny hunter kind of because then it doesn't make it as special um but i can i can get over that i guess if i want to be hardcore mode then i can always set up something else you know do a soft reset in a different game or go back to a different game and do a shiny like um or do egg hunts like this which is difficult makes the end game shorter exactly and pokemon for me is all about end game so that's when the game starts when you get a shiny charm is when the game starts for pokemon in my opinion but that's because i'm a fucking shiny hunter that's what i do So since um, one prize thing might not necessarily be what's the holdup, we might just need to find like a cool deck of like an ace mon that you like. But the format's so like new that there's not like a huge, huge amount of options. I need to get back into go heavy again if we are going to regionals. Oh yeah, you can, you can play in go. <laughs> That'd be kind of cool. Do they do it all at once? I think they do. Like go VGC and TCG. Like I know they do it for the big ones that we watch or whatever. But yeah, I guess some of those are regionals as well. So yeah, they would do it all right. Yeah, same weekend. That'd be so cool, too, because you could, like, take, like, a weekend trip somewhere. And then even if you, like, scrub out, you have, like, day or two to explore whatever fucking random city we're in. And if I really start getting into it, then I'll change my schedule where I don't even have to, like, take days off. You just go on the weekend. Who has smaller brackets so it's two days instead of three i think most tcg days are t uh two days i think because the third day is like literally like top eight usually so like the main two days are the first two days and then if you like get that fucking far then the third day is like literally the top eight or top four people in just those rounds is what they like play. I want a shiny sand dial. Yeah, same first day playing for top and second day is top. Yeah, I think with TCG, it's day one, day two, and then top. Damn it. Doing all that time without hatching.
Oh, you know what? Let's check these real quick. Just as far as stats go. Because now we're really only looking for like perfect IVs if we're going to swap out a parent or not. I switched them, yeah, okay, I did. God damn. So I want to say the most go players at event was like 130. TCG and VGC are a lot more. Yeah, TCG stuff is like in thousands. You know what's crazy in Japan since so many people like love Pokemon um, how regionals works is like you have like it's like everyone signs up and then it's like a raffle on if you even get into the regional. Also the first official season though. What do you mean the first official season? Or go. <clears throat> what do you mean? Like they've never had a, a season or like it's the first official season of like the year or something. Like the first time they've had like a regionals bracket. Explain yourself. Holy shit. <laughs> this whole bunch of hippos just spawn in. Ah! Yeah, first full go season in, in play Pokemon. Okay, that's cool though. Wow, that's crazy that it took that long though. Yeah, I remember in the beginning you telling me about, especially how like, how much you're into it is about like how people wanted it to be competitive so they started making their own like leagues and shit like because nobody was doing it covid delayed it ah still late as fuck i really need to do a three-star raid and since they don't give out fucking uh, remote passes anymore. It's like such a bitch to do. I need a three star raid to like complete a quest thing that will give me so much XP. And uh, all I'm trying to do is grind XP right now to get to level 40. Yeah, we used to play in self road tournaments. Yeah, exactly. That's cool. I like, I love when like fan people do stuff. Like fans like just have a love of something that they take it and do something with it. And each month was a different meta. Ah! Fuck you, Capsa kid. I hate you. Bad Pokemon. Your card looks pretty cool though. You're all art. certain types so it's always switched up and made you build random mons yeah that's pretty cool I just want a shiny poop boy 
Little gold nugget boy. I don't even know what type he is. Is it like bug? Bug? That or a go go. Been wanting a go go. Or it's not go, it's skadoo, and then it builds and it go go. Builds. Evolves. Jesus. Oh no, 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 please. Stop, please. This also should not be a fucking thing. I shouldn't let you have Pokemon fucking jump you while your eggs are hatching. It's bullshit. Damn it, stop. Or like while you're already in a fight. God, that's so fucking annoying. All right. <laughs> As you were, poop bug. That one's not bad. It has no attack, but it's better than having attack and no special attack. That one's pretty good. We're going to put it we're going to put it at the top. Ah. Ah. Thanks for the shiny luck, boy. We're gonna get it. It's gonna be this batch. This batch. Shiny's in this batch. Let everyone know. Shiny about to be on screen. Should always make me laugh. Shiny hunters tweeting out shiny on screen.
right it's not this one it's in this batch it's in here we know it is All right, it's one of these last three. It's definitely in here. Oh my God, it's a shiny nimble over there. Yo, we gotta get him. It was in the background. He might be running away. Cyndaquil, you're not shiny. It's gonna stop me. The eggs are gonna stop me. He's right there. Ah! I'm just talking about this. Let's go. I love this boy. Holy shit. What do we catch him in? <laughs> you gave me the shiny luck, dude. You did it. You you have no one else to blame as yourself. He can't keep getting away with it. He can't keep getting away with it. So we caught our low kicks in a... You know what? Let's go over the Ultra Ball. Even though it's like white and yellow, I still think it'd look fucking cool. Because what are the other options? Like fucking Quick Ball? Ultra Ball? Do we do Ultra Ball? I love him. I love him so much. I, I really do love Nimble. Like I don't really like bug type Pokemon, but I thought this little Grasshopper boy was so cool. Quick ball. No, I think it's ultra ball, even though it's kind of basic. Let's go crit catch. Yup. Yup. I am pokey master, dude. I am pokey master. Look at him. Oh, <laughs> they all learned smoke screen. <laughs> Oops. I love him. Come here. Look at him. You can't see him. Look at him. <laughs> no good anything. There's no way it's marked. Nope. But I don't care. He's just for the decks anyway. I love him. I also put all this stuff in order. I don't know why there's a space there. So I did this stuff based on generations. And I don't remember why there's a space there. Oh, I think it's the Nassily. Where was the space? It was after Smolov. I do want to get another Whooper. I want to get a Pooper just so we can have both. Is now me having the plushies. I feel like we just need the boys. The boys. Boom. That's how it was, right? And we got a little nimble. And we got our Trini. Sick. Always mud boys. Yeah, dude. I love my little plushies. They're so dumb. Uh, when, like I said, when we get the stream room or whatever, they will be on display. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. We got our nimble. Okay, so that's one of them. Just need a skidoo. And I wouldn't say no to a Mudsdale either. Or what's? It's not Mudsdale. Mudsdale's the evolution. But I don't have one of those. I definitely wouldn't say no to a Cyndaquil. And it's a good thing we're about to get it because it's the last egg in the batch that we said there's a shiny in. So 
Uh, we're about to get this right now. Here we go. Here's the shiny. I'm not even gonna look. Damn, dude. Damn. 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 Fuck you, Capsa kid. Your shit. I don't like you. Well, you're actually kind of okay, but Scovillian's god awful. I can't believe I saw it in the distance. I was like, wait. I, th I thought it was going to despawn. Right, the shiny look. Let's go. Oh, you know what's a good, um, like, one prizer type deal that apparently is coming out? Like, Annihilate. Annihilate is apparently really, really good. I don't know if it's like a tech in certain decks or if it's a full on deck, but people have been speculating about how good that card is. Those Mankey look tiny. They probably were. But yeah, that could be kind of cool. And that's like a new Gen 1 type thing, so maybe you'll dig that. Annihilate is like not even like an EX or anything. It's like a straight up one prize card. It's either that or like things that I know that are like one prizer stuff right now is uh, Don Dozo. I don't know how successful that card is, but people have talked about it. I like Ghost OG Perp. He's not a perp. He's fighting. Fighting type. Ooh, a monkey. Fighting ghost, I thought. Yeah. Yeah, he's fighting ghost. I'm saying like OG version is straight fighting like annihilate sure um, the card that I'm talking about is fighting type it, it's not a uh, psychic that would be another like three state or two stager so it could be good I don't know I don't know We'll figure something out. muted yep yep i just just it was my epiphany of this thing being called a mud spray and then evolves in mud steel could put my sticker on my deck box but kind of like it clean yeah yeah i feel you there i've i bought like multiple stickers because of my anxiety about like wasting the one sticker and i got like all of like some iconic favorite Pokemon that are like classic to me. Uh, I just don't know what to do with them all. I know one I'll put on my Switch dock. 
Is I put a sticker on my switch the last time I put my like Trev Machina sticker on there. Um, and I kind of regret that because I ended up giving it away and I had to like take it off and stuff. Um, but on the dock, it'll look good, especially since the dock is white with the OLED. It'll look good. Need to get a matte case and put it on that. That could be cool. Yeah, I guess you do need a, a matte tube. I need more as well, just to how many mats I have. I need one for my Charizard one now. And I have a couple of other mats that would be good for put in a tube. Right now they're just rubber banded. And I don't like that. I like everything being clean. Clean. All right, one more box. A green boy, but the case it comes in is a flex also. I need to get a matte case put on it. Yeah, a, a green boy, but the case it comes in flex also. Oh, like the plastic thing? <laughs> now it would look nice in like a, a green matte tube. Like if you got a matte tube where like the top is green and then it's just clear. I think that would look cool. And especially if you maybe put the Bulbasaur on the top. I got, um, I don't think he's here, but I got David a, uh, I got him, I got him these dice that looking at it now, cause I bought myself a pair. I, it, I regret not getting you some, but he, I didn't get him a mat. So I got him like small stuff, um, oh, like multiple small things. Um, <clears throat> but they're like dice that you get at the Pokemon center and, uh, it looks like they're like coin dice, like because it's a six sided die, but three sides have like one color or like one decal and the other three have a different decal. And it's like one through six, like a normal dice, but you could also use it as coin, which that's what they do anyway in the TCG. When you have a coin flip, you just roll dice and it's like odds and even evens and stuff like that. And then I got him a deck box that's Maridon because he's going to build a Maridon deck. Um, and then I got him, uh, stickers as well. I asked him what Pokemon he would want at the 151 and he said Ponyta and Tauros. So I got him those stickers. I get to give him that stuff tomorrow. Yeah. A Japanese Pokemon center package goes kind of hard. <laughs> That's why I'm excited about my Iono thing, dude, especially since how Iono is going to be the next Marty of the format. Like it's just in everything. I found that Iono deck box. It wasn't even at the Pokemon Center. It was in another card shop because I'm guessing they were selling it at a different time. Um, and I'm so glad I picked that up because that is like, I know it's like super cool. Oh no, I fell off. And no one's going to have that shit. I'm just worried about it, like, getting messed up, like, with where. Oh, that was the other thing that I got him. I got him a little, I guess, dice case, but I have so many dice that it won't fit that. So I'm using it for, like, my markers, but it's like a case like this. But instead of mine has little Pokeballs on it, it's got it's got Maridon on it and uh, Karidon. Um, but yeah, this, this deck box is pretty slick. And then I'm just going to use a pouch for my actual dice. 
I'm gonna get a different one though. This is just the one that I already had. I'm gonna try to find one that matches the deck box. I don't know, maybe either like red. If I could find a pink, that'd be pretty cool. Uh, but maybe a different color, just something that matches. I have mine in that tin I won on stream anniversary. Yeah, that actually works actually, thinking about it now. Yeah, having your dice in there is not a, uh, people actually do that at, at locals. The mini tents. I have a couple of those. They just released the new ones. And it's pretty cool because they come with two packs, right? Um, it comes with a Scarlet and Violet pack and it comes with the Silver Tempest pack. Which both of those ain't bad. Ain't bad. Oh, holy, we got our first perfect boy. Holy shit. Look at those stats. God damn. God damn. All right. He's the new parent for the. All right. God damn. No attack, everything else best. Damn, dude. Timid, that is a perfect Cyndaquil. Uh-oh. And it's Turtwig, so it kind of matches my aesthetic. That's pretty sick. You know what you should do? It might be a little expensive, but you can find the Celebrations tin where it has the original starters and there's a Bulbasaur one. Like it would probably be expensive for what it is, but that would be pretty fucking sick to use as your as your dice thing. That'd be that'd be awesome. I don't know. I do want to kind of get more celebrations packs because I never pulled that Charizard and I think it'd be really cool to have that, even though it's not worth a crazy amount. So if I do end up doing that, I'll buy that 10 and I'll give you the 10 because I, I wouldn't be opposed to that. Sounds like Trevor work. Yeah, it was literally already saying it. Literally already saying it. All right, let's see. That's my boy. <laughs> yeah, that's 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 the level of like aesthetic things all going together that sounds like some shit that i would do so i uh you know what i really regret i really regret not buying like fucking five of these fucking things because i dig them a lot and i like having every dice from every set that i've opened from each etb and it doesn't fit but I, so like if I would have had multiple, it would have been really like clean to have just carrying these around. Um, but what are you gonna do? I only bought one for myself um, and then one for David. And the one for David is specific to his, so. But I did buy these markers um, off of Etsy. And so that's what fits in here right now. Like this is all of my like utility stuff. But here, let's see if it'll show up. But I bought these. They're abil it's his ability used. And so it, it, it's how you can track what abilities you've already used on the Pokemon in that turn. Uh, before I just used coins, uh, but I bought those and they're, they're really fucking nice, so. And I bought two sets of them. So when I eventually start streaming IRL TCG stuff, I'll have enough for both players. And they look pretty clean. So right now that's what's in my little case. That, a V-Star marker, the the coin dice that I was talking about, and then my status uh, markers. Dude, I look for my D&D &D dice and can't find them, so pissed. They're a purple metallic flake, I missed them. Yeah, I remember you getting those. Don't worry, there will be a new era of d and I'm thinking about doing something like that, so. The only thing that sucks is I think I'll probably have to DM, which I kind of have come to terms with. So, 
I won't be able to play just a character, but I'll be able to play a whole bunch of characters, I guess. I just have to learn so much to do that. What? Uh, what? Oh, my thing's going out. That's why. The illusion is broken. Also, my camera's been real stupid lately. why but this has really been oh maybe it's because i have that setting on here oh yeah i guess it like helps hide it just a little bit Player's handbook to Mason graduation wrote inside the cover. Like a card. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I would there. Uh, that's pretty cool. Here, fuck it. Just deal with it. I'll fix that stuff later. Yeah, that that old uh I know he he'll he digs that a lot, so that's pretty cool. And I remember that thing. I have my own, like, set of books that I bought, like, a couple of years ago and then ended up not doing anything with it, but I will. Uh, I would like to play. It'd be cool. So, uh, right now, my big project is probably uh, making this vlog all together, so, and I haven't even started yet, so. That's sick. What what quote did you put? The Dark Times quote? I love that. So now we need a perfect Pokeball, boy. It looks like this one's mostly Pokeball. We could just selectively breed like one Pokeball one with the best ditto that we have and it'll probably get us damn close to having a perfect one. Uh, but really, it doesn't matter. We can always bottle cap it. And like I said, I will always get like a shiny with fucking like two IVs when the parents have perfect IVs. So all we have to decide is what to do with the time that is given to us. Fuck yeah. It's the dark times quote. Uh, So good. So fucking good. I need 
I need a Pokemon tattoo and I need a Lord of the Rings tattoo. Then arguably probably like a Blade Runner tattoo. I think that like encompasses all the all the shit. It's hard to decide those those tattoos though. It's like so many things that I can get, but like I don't want something that's like overdone or like and I never fucking fought any trainers ever, so like their designs are like crazy. Like I've never seen this trainer. It's so funny. That's actually a bummer about this game. Like you not being forced to fight people. I just fucking skipped everyone because I didn't need to. I got enough levels by catching every Pokemon that I saw for the decks that I didn't have to do anything. Definitely need the Lord of the Rings <clears throat> and the original badges on my knuckles. <laughs> the original badge on my knuckles is ridiculous. It, it is eight though, it kind of fits. Oh, hit the mic. Sorry, Jet. Yeah, I don't know what to <clears throat> do with the Pokemon one at all. <clears throat> Lord of the Rings one, I kind of want the leaf because that's like the whole point. The fellowship. Uh, but <clears throat> not, I'm not entirely sure. Hash hat symbol in the thumbs. Get down, Mr. President. Oh, clipping through. What's under there? What's under the, what's under the world? Nothing. Oh, God damn it. Rock rough. I kind of want a pinup. Um, and so I'm wondering if I should be extra as fuck and get like Cynthia as a pinup. Uh, but I have no idea what to do with Pokemon. Pokemon's hard because I don't want it to be cheesy. OG Pokedex on my palms. This has gone too far. What the? You piece of shit. Ah.
Man, my camera is being stupid today. have to worry about this my fucking gopro would work god fucking damn it and i have no way of like i i, I would need somebody with the exact same problem to figure out to help me figure out what the hell how to fix this and it's almost impossible so i've fucked with it so much Wow, how majestic the sun going down. That'd have been cool. If it was shiny. Don't worry, I'll replicate the moment. Where's the sun? Oh, it's already gone down. Damn. Here's the shiny. Nope, no shiny. Yos. I'm out. No idea about the GoPro. Just regular Go. <laughs> yeah. Is that a shiny? Is that a shiny Silicobra? No, they look the same. It's just fucking. Unless they're both shiny. Oh my god. Look how Flittle flies. It kicks its little feet. It kicks its little feet. Did you see that? I can't even. Here, look. What a, is it enough? Is that was that enough time? Look at this fucking guy. Yeah, it's going to show it. Look at Flittle. Look how we go. Look. Oh my god. Look, look at it. Here it go. Look at him. Look at him. Look, look at it. Look at it. Kick her little feet. Oh my god. <laughs> I've never noticed that. That's so adorable. What the fuck? That is so funny. God damn it. I think for Lord of the Rings tat, I would get sting somewhere. Sting. You've seen it before, haven't you? It's just, I already have a weapon on my arm that that's the go-to of like Lord of the Rings thing would be cool to get, like Arendelle and stuff like that. And it's like, what am I gonna have? Like a weapon arm sleeve? Like what the fuck? So that's why I didn't, I, I, like the broken sword would be super cool to get, but it's like, I already have a fucking lance on my arm, like a spear on my arm. With black lighting, that'd be sick. Okay. 
game is struggling. I think it needs to be restarted. Let's save. Double save. Once I move, I will holla at your boy. Does he do color? I'm a color boy. No, not really. He only does like red. That's like his whole thing. It's like black and white and red. There's a different artist that I really like, um, but she's kind of hard to get booked, I believe. And she expensive. Um, but yeah, no, August only does like black and white and red. Like I still have to get my tattoo completed and I have to figure out somebody else that will do it. It won't be a lot. It's going to be like small as fuck and really quick, but I do want it with color. And so that's why I like told him, just don't worry about it. I'll get somebody else to do that bit. And mine just so happened to be like red and like black and white. So it worked out. Like, but yeah, that's his style is that he does just like black and white with red accent tattoos. So he won't do full color. Need to get mine fixed first and some Scottish stuff to my clovers for our clan apparently. Um, yeah, I need a little bit of touch up on my tattoo, but it's like very minimal. It's it's just like line stuff. That pretty much only bothers me, but it does bother me. It's one little bit essentially that needs to be touched up. It seems so long ago that I got my tattoo, but it's really only been like four months. One last row. Damn, this one's pretty good, except it doesn't have special attack. Uh, it's probably the best one, though. Let's see. Okay, this one didn't have any of that, so it's probably the best contender. This does have special attack, which is good. So we might be able to like breed it to get a perfect one. Ooh, it's hard. All right. It's pretty damn close to being perfect. Last row. My American flag looks like trash. It needs help. <laughs> I 
We at least want to get this one completed. That's shiny. Nope. Um, <clears throat> I at least want to get mine shiny. Or what the fuck? I at least want to get mine finished and uh, and then figure out the next one to do. So I don't just have one tattoo. I don't know. I kind of want where it like will cohesive be a sleeve, but I don't know how I would like mesh everything together, honestly, since they are so wildly different. And I want to keep it all on one arm because I don't want random sporadic tattoos everywhere. Uh, but. Like, I kind of want to hold off on, like, if I could fill up a full arm of other stuff that maybe I would do my entire right arm with, like, Pokemon stuff. Like, that could be cool, but I don't know. Of course, they didn't tell me, but I was the dude's first tat when I was 19. Damn, that sucks. It, like, pieces, like, just puzzled and not a sleeve guy i like pieces just puzzled puzzled not a sleeve guy um it really depends on how it is i i don't know i would prefer a sleeve that's why i'm trying to allocate everything to one arm because even if they are separate pieces and they don't flow into each other uh it will all be in one spot so you could like fill it in with small stuff and all this kind of shit. That's why, like I was saying, it's like if I put a whole bunch of random shit on my left arm and like if it was like pieces put together, like mosaic into like that style and then my right arm did like a full fucking sleeve of just like Pokemon, that would be pretty sick because it'd be completely starkly different. Uh, but I don't know if I want double sleeves. I, I kind of like the idea of having one arm all the way done. And that's pretty much it. Oh yeah, this is our last fucking column. Damn, that was our last one. All right, let's see here. We got eh, not anything crazy good. We did get a perfect one though. That's pretty damn good. The hell? Oh, did I do that wrong? Okay, there it goes. All right, we got our parents here. Pretty damn good. Pretty damn good and perfect here. Um, Let's put our... Let's put our Pokemon catchers on here. Got distracted, was talking DBZ with the neighbor kid. <laughs> you can't beat Goku. And then we're gonna do the... We're gonna do our like Japanese pavilion here. 
So, but I'm gonna go P first. <laughs> kind of forgot how to do this, but I think it's pretty straightforward, I think. Be right back. Yo, motherfuckers! We fucking did it! Day one! You should have bet! You should have fucking bet! Holy shit! Yes! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> fucking day one! And it's neutral nature! Look at him! Look at him in all his bugged out glory! Yo! No fucking way. Was not expecting that. It's, it's just worth saying, like, multiple times. You take cheese, shredded cheese, all right? Queso, if you will, but not melted. All right. That's not then, queso. Well, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's a girl. Fuck, I know, that's fine, I don't <laughs> give a shit. Oh my god! Fucking hell! Oh, Holy man. shit! I'm trying to make it cozy where I can talk to y'all and I don't have to turn my head. There you go. Have you prayed this? Oh my god. My dyslexia. That was a real bad goof. I read that as have you sprayed to. Uh, cut that, cut that, cut that, cut that, cut that, cut that, cut that. Cut that. This is what I think of you. This is what's gonna be going on at the Pearl Clan, right? No. All right, so you can see it still. So usually I loosen it a little bit. Scared. Here we go. This one's working actually. Hey! <laughs> there you go. I didn't fucking ruin it. <laughs> yep, absolutely scared my cat. It's done. <laughs> well, there's a monkey. Oh my god, my thing's gonna blow up. <laughs> Hey, what's up? What's up? You can read without opening your mouth! Oh, I thought he was gonna blow up. I missed it. David, get the law while you're down there! You know what? I'm going with you! Shoot me over! You can't let him get lower, not me! What the fuck is this? There you go. Let's go! Oh, ow, ow! Oh, no! No! 
guess who's not Nugu Goofin? That's... She can do like three gym leaders, two star falls. See, she can do it too. Oh my gosh! You're already done with the Path of Legends? It's so close to being done with the game. I slammed my penis in the car door. <laughs> what? <laughs> You've never seen that? <laughs> it's a song that somebody made. I. <laughs> you know, bitches are temporary. Shiny Drutini is forever. You know what I'm saying? Wait, wait, wait. Before we go, can I go pee? Yeah, go. Uh, <laughs> I'm asking. Oh, um, teacher, can I go pee? <laughs> because I don't want y'all sign up. <laughs> Alright, whatever. I'll go fuck myself, I guess, for being polite. <laughs> fuck, fuck me, right? Go. I'm back. Bye, babe. Alright. Let's figure out how this fucking thing works again. There's a quillfish, I have to catch it. Should have silver pineapple buried it. <clears throat> Why is this fucking thing freaking the fuck out? You're gonna be okay, bro? Jesus, that's why I'm trying to replace you. All right, no finikin. I need this Fomantis. I need grass Pokemon. Perfect timing. Had to teach a kid how to use iron. He has a concert tomorrow. Iron. What the hell are you talking about? Iron in concert. All right. <clears throat> Let's see. So you do settings. Connected devices, Nintendo Switch, Link linking with Scarlet and Violet. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Available devices found. So I have to do this thing. It gets mystery gift. Yeah, connect to Pokemon Go. Connect to Pokemon Go. Oh, I was like, what the hell are you talking about? Uh, Nintendo Switch. Uh, blah, blah, blah. You'll be able to connect to Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Uh, prepare Pokemon Go. Prepare your Pokemon Go game. In the menu. Pokeball. Blah, blah, blah. Connected devices. Tap Nintendo Switch. Available devices. Okay, I think I might have to connect to the internet before I do this. Even though I think it's over Bluetooth. Yeah, dude, I want this thing. It's chestnut. Connect to Pokemon Go. Connect to Pokemon Go. Or is it pair? Do I have to pair first? Help! 
first select pair okay okay enough with the help how do i get out of here figure it out guys Fuck this up. Nintendo Switch. Pair of the Pokemon Go. Okay. Connect to a Nintendo Switch. It's right there. It's right there. There it goes. Wow. <laughs> Here, now try connecting the Pokemon Go. It's working. It's possibly working. When connected to Pokemon Go with the Pokemon Scarlet Violet, it's very limited. You see the help water come from her. Okay, uh, limited data will be shared. I think now I can go to like my postcards or something. Send a Nintendo Switch. Send. Yes. Are you sure you want to switch? Yeah, yes. Now I do. Okay, so what the fuck? Is that how it's doing? <clears throat> oh my god, it's happening! Oh, I forgot it gives you fucking gimme gold coins. That's pretty sick, actually. <laughs> All right, now we can go get cool pavilions. That's a frost moth. Those are gold ducts.
I think it has to be during the daytime, I'm gonna be honest. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it has to be during the daytime. Now we just have to wait. What the fuck? Oh, no, it's right there. Whoa, look how cool. This is like the elegant form or some shit like that. Hypnosis. So cool. Of course, of course, you're not going to make this easy. I could ball swipe you. I don't think you're going to hurt yourself. Yeah, stay asleep. You're mine now. Bad ass. I believe that was a form that I didn't even have. Elegant pattern. Distant seasons, scattered colorful toxic scales. So cool. And there's a whole bunch. So if anybody were to join my game, they'd be able to get these. Now, I don't know where this one goes. Why does that sound like a song? GTS guide. Okay, it's this one. Yeah, it's this one. So elegant goes right next to the other one that I have. It goes right here. That's so cool. I love him. Now I need to figure out how to like contact other people and Is I don't really know how much I have. I don't really think I have much more. I have the I think I have the modern pattern. Y'all guys can't see this stuff. Um, here. There you go. I think that's good, actually. 
So what I'm looking at here, that's what I'm looking at. Um, I believe I have the modern pattern. Maybe the meadow pat. No, 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 the modern pattern. No, 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 that's the Pokeball one. Never mind. I don't know what all I have actually. Because I think I only have like two other ones, and one of them is this one, um, in the GTS or like in the. Where's this at, by the way? This one's not on here. Why? Dude, that monsoon one looks cool as shit. <clears throat> Here, let's save. So I am curious about what I have. Oh, we can look at Pokemon Home. So I have three in game. All right, I technically have four. I have the normal, like, fancy one. You think it's fancy? What it's called? Yeah, fancy. Yeah, so all I had is the modern pattern and then the fancy one. Um, so it goes fancy and then Pokeball. And Pokeball was only like an exclusive giveaway. Hi, Cage. Hi there. What's up? Thanks for the first time chat. Just looking at Vivillions. Vivion? I don't know how you pronounce it. I always said Vivillion. But I'm a fool. I know there might have been a way to like link up with other people to join their game to get other pavilion patterns, but I don't know how. So in total, I have three, five, six, six out of the just saw that you were looking for pavilion. I got the monsoon and marine one. If you want, I'm not too big into collecting them. Um, and like in, how, how did you get them? Cause I, I want them, but I want them in my OT cause I'm a freaking idiot. I'm so stupid. Um, like, did you do the Pokemon go thing? And do you have it saved? Because if you have the postcard saved, then if you do that, then you can do it on your on your game and then I can join. And I also have the I have the elegant one because I just came back from a trip from Japan. Um, here look, we can leave this. So I literally just did the elegant pattern one.
I wonder if they're gonna show up still or if me turning off. Nope, they are. Cool. So I still have elegant pattern ones. Yeah, I'll show you. See, I have. I've, I've gotten these so far. That's the high plains. This one is the garden and then this is elegant. And then I already had the modern, which goes here. And then I have a fancy one, which is this one. So I only have six in total out of the 12, eight, 20 different pavilion patterns. Vivian, is it Vivian? Pavilion. I actually think it is Viv Viv Vivian because of the French. It is from the Kalos region. Apparently, the bitch ones to get are, I think it's the, I think it might be the monsoon one, honestly. Monsoon one and the, I think it's the either tundra or something like that. Let's see if I can. It's V V L L O N. Easy way to obtain all the million patterns, getting them in 3DS Pokemon games, transferring to Pokemon Home, and then moving them, blah, 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 blah. What is the rarest pavilion pattern? Pokeball and Fancy. Technically, these are ones of the rares because no one has them yet. Um, That's in Pokemon Go. So Archipelagio, the elegant one's kind of hard because it's only in Japan, but uh, I already got that one. Central Europe for Meadow, Southeast US for Modern. That was mine, I believe. Southeastern, maybe not actually. Archipelago, yeah. Sun is Mexico and Madagascar. I need a homie in Mexico, dude. Tundra. I need friends on Pokemon Go from different places. I think there's a way to do this too. Discord, yeah. I know when it first came out, a <clears throat> uh, video that I saw was saying that they were putting like a like a thing together where you could be friends with people from all around. I just need to do that so I can try to do that. Like, it would be sick as fuck to get all of these. I can't get the Pokeball one, but I'm hoping that they re-release that because the last time that they did it was in Kalos and this is the first time it's ever been in a game since then where you can even remotely get them. So I'm hoping they gift that out again. The Pokeball uh, Vi Vivian. It's right now I have six and there's 
20 in total, including the Pokeball one. So honestly, not awful, but not great either. Never got an alert for this. Shame on you. I put it on Discord. It's on Instagram. If you follow and you get a notification, we be here. Right now we're looking at butterflies and their different patterns. This is the Japanese exclusive pattern that I got while I was in Japan. What the hell? How'd y'all get up here? It would be cool if, I, I don't know. Ball, are you able to man in the chair some type of pavilion fucking discord or some shit? Because right now I do have the Jap Japanese one open. So I would assume that would be a hard one to get. People might want that. Because if you join into everyone's game and everyone has different ones in this meadow over here, like all of them will be spawning like all the different ones not just yours so that's like a good way to like knock them out um you get like a whole bunch of people in one game i guess four people is the total right four four yeah vivian is my favorite pokemon you're a, you're lying what you're lying you lying liar, dude. I know big go discords, but not specific, specifically for butterfly. Who has three other friends though? I know that's what I'm saying, dude. I'm trying to figure this shit out, bruh. And also since it's been like a month or so since they did this, people are gonna be like, oh, I've already done it already. I did it day one. Cause I'm try hard as fuck and I have friends. Ah! Oh god, it's this clip. Let's do a Scarlet and Violet randomizer. How? How? Oh, it's chugging. It doesn't like it. Oh. Trying to eat a whole burger in one bite and you don't even get close, dude. It was two bites. There's no way it's not humanly possible. Well, that freaked me out. Dave's double and two bites. Here, what, what what do we all have? Do we have ingredients to make sandwiches? Eh, we kind of do. New goal is Dave's triple in two bites. Sounds like you're gonna choke live on stream. <laughs> what is that? What is that? What is that? <laughs> yeah, who's Dave? Nah, I got that big mouth. That big mouth. Oh! Oh, oh yeah? 
Wait, is this sandwich shop or is this sandwich ingredients? Because I need ingredients. The sandwich shop. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. I need picks. I really need ingredients. I need picks and I don't know where you buy those. I, I think it went. Uh, it's been so long. I think you might be able to buy them here. I don't know. I don't think so. I think, yeah, I have to go to a stupid. No, I'm good. Thanks. I'm an idiot. Went to the wrong shop. I love these pictures. Like that picture is so good. It's here somewhere. See people, I see people do randomizers in this and I have no idea how that works. I imagine you need a modded switch. Yeah, that's usually how it, it worked in the past too. Like uh, people did like sword and shield randomizers and that was all done on a modded switch. I have no idea how that, it's, it's above my pay grade. I don't know how it works either, bud. Okay, that's where I need to go. We're not in the big leagues for that info. Yeah. Also, it's fucking money, bro. I'm sure that's money, dude. To get, uh, like, I don't know how people were like PokeTubers before the Switch because in order to get, um, like, to capture 3DS stuff, you had to mod a 3DS. And there, it was one guy doing it, like, literally one dude that was doing it. And so to get it was really expensive. And then now he stopped doing it. So now to get it done, like to, you have to buy one of the old ones. So they're like a couple grand <laughs> to like do it. And I would love to be able to like capture my 3DS stuff, but it's just impossible. And like it would sometimes it just wouldn't work. What the hell? I want the picks, bruh. Where do you buy picks from? I know where the big city is where I've gotten them before. I saw, I saw people do emulators. Yeah, people like that. That was the other option, right? It was spend all this money to get a modded 3DS. Because I looked into this recently because I would I would love to like go back and play older games, especially since I have a lot of them. Um, it, it would get a modded uh, 3DS, which is a lot of money, and then sometimes just would not work. Um, but the other option was to... It's you do this thing where you like... You like play on an emulator, but you can like copy the save data onto your actual cartridge so it's like real kind of so as long as you're not like fucking with it it's still like a legit pokemon God damn it where are the fucking thingies tablecloth cup bottle i thought it was here where the fuck is it Definitely not there. It's definitely not there. Not there. And I was thinking about trying to figure out how to do that second option, but I don't know if I'm that smart, you know? Oh, this is not it. This is Chansey Supply. You ain't got what I'm looking for. Somebody tell me how this game works. Where, where do I buy picks, dude? Is it this? No. 
It's gonna be like coffee. Yeah, it's coffee. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Lost someone. Okay, here, look, let's see. What are our options here? We were just at that. Okay, all right, okay, okay, okay. Artisan bakery. Okay, all right. Delivered presents. Is it this? There's no way. Chancy supply. No, it's not delivered presents. It might be the one of these things. Just lost at Nickelodeon Smash Bros. Oh no, do not bring that up around Cowboy, dude. Cowboy, look away. You don't have to read every comment, it's okay. Oof. <laughs> Is this it? It's because I wasn't a turtle. Lemon gelato. That's how the Pokemon Cafe food looks like. Oh, accessories. Yes. This is what I need. Goddamn. Remember when that game was coming, kind of excited, then it came out and was DLC announced day one. What do you mean? You played the shit out of that game. Isn't that the game that I'm thinking about? Shame about multiverses though. Yeah, that's what I, that's what I thought you're, oh, I thought it was the same thing. What is this place? Can I go in here? No. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. Uh oh. I'm looking at the outbreaks, see what we got. Nothing interesting. Nope. Whole lot of nothing. It was number 20 Jake in the world. Let me see if I can figure out this whole pavilion thing. Cause that'd be kind of cool to do.
All right, I might have figured something out. Find it, add global friends. Neighborhood kid made me play, not mad at it. Hey, hey, you stop that. You stop it. Yo, yo. This is sick. Okay, I don't need that. I don't need that. Wait, is it meadow? No, that one. I need that. Wait, is it guarded? Fuck. What all do I have? This is sick. Yo, this is actually so cool. The hell? What the heck? I should probably like here window capture. I'm a donkey on the edge. I'm a donkey on the edge. So, um, apparently this leak duck, like uh, you can't see the top them. Um, website. They're the people that do all of the 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 Pokemon Go like infographics and everything, and they set up. A thing already like when it first came out Look how fucking good I am at shit. Anyway, um, so you can, so now I just need to figure out which pavilion I have already. So I have this one. So that's, okay. So we're gonna reselect everything. I have Elliot, I have Garden, I have High Plains. I have the fancy one, which is not even an option on here, which is weird. Um, I also have the modern. And I have one other one. Which one is it? Right? Because I had six, didn't I? Four? No, maybe I only have five. So I have these three. I had modern and then fancy. So now... I don't know if this is meaning that I need these ones. Uh, select a pavilion you want. You want to show hide and press the refresh button filter. I don't know how this stuff work. I think. Remember, be kind, exchange gifts, somebody return the favor. Okay. So, oh, I copied the trainer code. That's fucking crazy, dude. Go infographic. Yeah, that's so this is what the website is. So now I can go on to like my Pokemon Go thing. 
and add friends or whatever QR code and because you can even do the QR code one oh, why is it so tiny bruh I'm just gonna send every fucking like every like thing that I don't have a so who is that? Here's your chance, fancy, don't let us down. Oh shit, it tells you the pavilion patterns that they have. Okay, so that was the jungle one. That's the savannah one. That's the... That's the continental one. But this guy, I need this guy. Yo, this is actually insane. <laughs> I don't know if they'll add me back, but I'm gonna tr I'm gonna fucking try. All right, we got that one. So let's fuck around with this one. Boss Hobbit, let's go. Let's see what we just did. So let's mark off the ones that we just did to try to. That was jungle. That was continental. That was marine. And that was polar. So let's do this meadow one real quick. And then maybe we'll. We'll refresh it. Oh, invalid trainer. What the hell? There's a gar full on Gardevoir in front of my home. Why? You better get in the goddamn ball. I like how people are watching me do nothing right now. Welcome. Welcome. Summoned with your simp magic. I'm, well, I'm, I am playing Gardevoir. Because all I need to do is send gifts to these people or like exchange gifts with them and uh, then I can save their postcards and do them all myself. But I only can do it once a day, I think. It's all the 3D models for the game I'm making. What? You want charm as your fast move. <laughs> it's got confusion. It doesn't have good stats. I only caught it because I have a, a hundred. I have a hundred, uh, like a perfect Gardevoir. Add friend, QR code. Yeah, this one's saying it's invalid for some reason. So that one no work. That was a modern one. Here, let's do this real quick. Okay, here's a Tundra one. Interesting. He's in Japan now. It says the Tundra. And Tundra is super important, I think. Tundra is like one of the hardest ones to get. Um, Capination. The fuck is that one? Oh, it's a Savannah one.
That was Savannah and Tundra. Oh, I think the ocean one is another hard one to get. I'm just doing one of each one. Man, this one's invalid for whatever reason. River. And I got a P already. Okay, this is another modern one. Or meadow one. I apologize. Fucking my shit up. Okay, this one worked. Is there like a limit of how many... Like, did you see them? That works. Also depends on what you want to do. Bots. Discord, probably easier. You can post your code and they come to you. Yeah, but I've got a lame ass one. I don't think that like it would matter. So that's why like me going to them is kind of good. So let's do that. We're slowly narrowing it down. Okay, we got ocean here. Let's do that. I just wish it would stay on this fucking screen because it's annoying. Oh no. I think a lot of these have been failing because they have too many friend requests. Yeah, I have no idea if any of these have gone through. Damn. I haven't been checking that. I think we have to start all over. Okay, let's start with this guy. Nope, that one didn't work. <clears throat> this is jungle. Failed. You have already sent an invite to this trainer. Okay, so that was a jungle one. So hopefully he gets back to me, you know. <laughs> um... Okay, this one is the Savannah one. Okay, we got this guy, Continental. You're already friends with this trainer, let's go! Somebody did add me already. Wait, how am I already friends with them? This is the only new person I see. Is it this? <laughs> Shanghai.exe? Damn, he's level 50, bro. I must send him. He's gonna be pissed because all I have is Japanese gifts. I don't have any normal ones right now. <laughs> he's gonna be like, <laughs> I was trying to get another one. Here, I sent him a gift to see if he sends me a gift back. Okay, that was the Continental guy, actually.
Thomas. Let's try Thomas. Already sent an invite to Thomas. Okay, cool. So that is Tundra one. It'll be easier when I'm like narrowing it down. Okay, I already sent an invite to the boss hobbit. Boss hobbit was polar. Pokemon Tinder stream, let's go. That's exactly what's happening. Wait, I already did Thomas. Nose Marine. Ew. La Poodala. Okay. Ingenious. I've already sent one too, and that was the river one. Vanny main. Okay, so this guy got too many. Monsoon one. You already did Thomas chat. Clip it. Awesome. That one worked. That was. Okay. That was the monsoon one. Narrowing it down. We want to send at least one friend request to every single area. And then I just start sending gifts like crazy. And then receiving gifts, make sure where they're from, tag them, and then we try it every day. Moni. I have to pee. Damn. Damn. This person's definitely not going to work. Yep. Too many friend requests. working my way down the line, you know. Um 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 What? Why are you gifting subs? What up, Trim? Thank you so much for the gifted sub. That one worked. That was snacks. And that was a meadow one. We're doing some weird ass shit, Trim. How's it going? Enjoy your emotes. Oh no, it's very slim pickings now. 
Nobody with Archipelago. Let's... So that one didn't work. Number two, I'm pretty sure didn't work already. We already did this. Yeah. This seems familiar as well. Nope. This also seems familiar. Nope. Whatever this is. Nope. I right, got two more to try and I'm pretty sure these ones do not work last one yo this one worked hopefully they get back to me that was icy snow so these are the ones that like nobody had. Just got home from work. Right now. Yeah, so. I don't know what I do here, but I definitely have had. Like, I got more friends. I think I got two new people. I guess you know what I look for people that I don't have any but you won't receive other items because your item bag is full so I pin that to my postcard okay I got somebody and I just pinned their postcard, but they're from Japan and I'm about to send them a fucking Japanese goddamn gift because I don't have any other gifts. They really just made that like a thing right now. You can open gifts now without having to receive anything. Like you can just get Stardust for it. Stardust. Should change the thing. We're playing Pokemon Go now. Just kidding. I'm just kidding. Okay. I have no idea what we're doing though. What's going on? Hi. I, I, when did y'all get here? I don't even know what we're doing. What are we doing? What are you people doing? In, yeah, what are you people doing? In my, how'd you get in my This is even my house. Where am I? Who are you? Just watch me be a crazy person for like 15 minutes. Okay, let's do a little cheeky date skip. See if anything cool shows up and we might hunt it. Estrevis. Frostlass. Bronzor. Dreepy. Venema. Noibat. We got all that crap. What's my name? Who 
too. That's interesting. Stupid swan thing. You know what? Let's get a fucking gold bug. Let's do it. I don't know what typing it is. What freaking typing is this thing? See, I want a sand dial as well. That Swablu got a huge buff in this game. It's psychic bug, is it really? Because that makes it really easy to hunt in here, actually. So everything in here is ground. Okay, roller is just bug type, which still makes it easy as fuck. And then sand dial is dark type, so we could actually do that as well. I think I'd want a sand dial more. Um, we can do the bug thing as well, uh, but let's do dark. That seems kind of fun. Um, we'll do that right when I get back, because I have to piss so bad. But we'll get ourself a sand dial well there's volcarona yeah but not in the area where the poop bugs are but i'll be right back Yo, motherfuckers! We fucking did it! Day one! You should have bet! You should have fucking bet! Holy shit! Yes! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Look at them. Fucking day one! And it's neutral nature! Look at him! Look at him in all his bugged out glory! Yo! No fucking way. Was not expecting that. <laughs> oh no! Yeah, what are you, what are oh you, no! What are you oh no! I can't, I can't! I can't! I can't do this! I have to do this on screen now. What are you doing? Oh my god, worst thing ever. Somebody clip that. Cut that, Somebody cut that, cut that, cut that, cut that, cut that, cut that, cut that. Get on it. It's just silent too, because there's nothing going on. <laughs> Bye, babe. The, uh... Wait, 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 before we go, can I go pee? Yeah, go. Uh... <laughs> I'm asking. <laughs> um, um, teacher, like... can I go pee? <laughs> Because I don't want y'all to- <laughs> Alright, whatever. I'll go fuck myself, I guess, for being polite. <laughs> fuck, fuck me, right? Yo, hard, Trevor, you know my eyes are- You can right. read without opening your mouth! And... It's done. <laughs> well, there's a monkey. Oh my god, my thing's gonna blow up. <laughs> hey, what's up? <laughs> what's up? <laughs> That's... She can do like three gym leaders, two star balls. See, she can do it too. Oh my gosh, you're already done with the path of legends? All right, we're back. Let's do this. Let's figure out how to picnic. I think we can picnic up here. Hello, is this thing on? Yes, it is on. Thanks everybody for chilling. Now we gotta figure out how to... We just saved, right? So we're good. We gotta figure out how to do the dark sandwich. 
There it is. Oh my god, dark sandwich is kind of awful. Also, I wonder what level these are. I don't think they're too crazy, which would be nice. So we need tomato, we need onion, we need green bell pepper, and we need, I believe, two hamburger. And then we need two herb. You know what we could do? We could use all, use our salty herb and not do it like this. So what you can do for dark type is smoke filet and just two any, so we don't have to worry about it. So do we have smoked filet? I believe we have everything. Am I fucking wrong? Am I fucking, okay, no, we're good. Salty, and then we'll use the sour, right? Yeah. Just so we don't have to fuck around. I kind of need a backup dark type in case we get this boy really quickly. What's a cool dark type? Doesn't that look like a delicious meal? Oh, you were saying Swablu gets Will-O-Wisp. Will-O-Wisp is pretty good. Nice, okay. We are good to go. Let's go get us a sand dial. Oh, I think cacturns will be dark as well. Oh, whoa. Juked ya. Okay. Here they go. Here they start spawning in. Fucked out of them. Moonstone. So this one should be pretty loud. I believe it's like yellow. And luckily they like spawn in like packs like this. So it should be even easier to spot because it'll be starkly different from the others. The sparkles are tripping me out though. That's why I'm picking them up. Freaked me out. So they don't spawn over here. They like spawning in this area.
be just looking, looking for duck or duck. <laughs> croc. It's a crocodile or is it an alligator? I think it's a crocodile. Crocodile, right? Yeah. Alligators are water based. Crocodiles are more on land, right? See, I know stuff. Thanks, Pokemon. Crocodiles are ground type. Primarily. And alligators are water type. I would actually want to catch this thing at night if it shows up because that'd be pretty sick. It might have a like a nighttime mark on it, which would be cool. They're level 23, which is kind of high, but not like outrageous in order to use on a team. And this is pretty much the only way to find them, so... What are you doing? What do you think you're doing? Where you going? Look at that boy. Damn, I did the wrong thing. Damn, we're only five minutes in. We got some time. Oh my god, the flittles are freaking me out. I'm at this point where they all look yellow.
real quick sand aisle yeah it's like bright ass fucking yellow should be able to notice can tell how like some of them are way bigger than the other ones kind of cool fucking big hit oh is that a shiny is that a shiny I found him. I found a shiny. Yo. Intimidate. That's very cool. I didn't know I had to intimidate. Awesome. Okay, so now I have no idea what the fuck to catch this in, actually. I didn't even think about that. So I really like the second evolution shiny. Ugh. And then the... Final evolution is straight up brown and yellow. Oh, man. I don't know. I think I might. I think I might capture this one. in a quick ball so I can evolve it into a Krokorok and keep it that way and then if we get another one I don't know what I would want a crocodile in though fuck maybe just an ultra ball I'm gonna do quick ball for this one. Let's go. All right, let's check it. Does it got a mark? Nope. No mark. It's timid though. I don't think that's good. It's not good. It's got intimidate. If I get another one, I don't know. Like that's the one that I would let evolve all the way and I have no idea what I would catch it in. You definitely can notice. I noticed it from far off, so. Ooh, we need to get it out of our party, actually. What is this fucking in Unova? Put it right there for right now. I think it might just be an ultra ball for Krokorok. Cause like there's 
around. Yeah, yeah, honestly, it's probably the ultra ball. Let me see if there's any other dark type Pokemon that I would actually be interested in getting anyway. Uh, that's not in my game. Oh, Ponyard. We can have another stab at Ponyard. Because we need a boy. I'm wondering if we should just beeline to do that. Sableye. Zora. Low kicks is dark. Okay. Uh, I'm kind of tempted. What are we at? You know what? Fuck it. Let's do it. Because I want one to build one. I don't really need to build a Krokorok. I just wanted it because I love... I love the second evolution shiny. It's very good. <clears throat> So we can look up, look for Ponyards and Ponyard. I do want to build. And we got a female one and I can't make a um, female King Gambit. It doesn't feel right. It's got a mustache. Since it's nighttime, Murkrows are popping up. God, all of them look fucking blue because of this metallic thing. Okay, and that Murkrow thought, <laughs> I thought that was a Ponyard that was blue.
They, they so look blue. I remember the shiny standing out, but man, is it annoying that all of them kind of look blue. <laughs> and the one that I found that was shiny was all alone. So that's good as so I can actually like endpoint it. It means if it is with a group, it'll stand out even more. Oh my God, I really thought that one was shiny. Man. Also, if I see a deerling outbreak, I think I'm gonna go for it because I really want one. Just haven't done it. Dude, dude. They look fucking blue. Little ninja knives. Monkey. Monkey. That one looked blue. It's not blue. That one looked blue too. It's not blue. This one looked blue. They all look blue. At least this one's an easy Pokeball pick. Look at all these shiny Ponyards. It's crazy. Pokemon equal Hotel California? What do you mean? check out anytime you want but you can never leave that's what i figured you meant uh what do you think is the worst like fandom like you got like pokemon people you got like uh what's it called like harry potter nerds you got like the the disney adults you got marvel people i think disney adults are pretty bad I think it might go like Disney, Harry Potter, like as far as like the most extreme like versions of those fandoms. I think it might go like Disney, Harry Potter, Pokemon, then Marvel probably. 
Like, I think Marvel's too, like, mainstream where... God, all of you look fucking blue! You all look blue. Good day, how's it going? What up, Matt Flo Mac? It's going pretty all right. We're trying to get a shiny Pontiard that's not a female because I don't feel that it's ethical to evolve a female Pontiard into a King Gambit when it has a mustache. That might be me gatekeeping mustaches, but I personally don't want to do that because I already got a shiny Pontiard, but it's a female. <laughs> We just straight chillin', shiny hunting. I mean, Alakazam has a mustache. Yeah, you right. I don't want a female. Al oh, actually, female Alakazam's mustache is smaller. I think. Those aren't mustache. That's whiskers. King Gambit straight up has mustache. I don't know what the fuck. Alakazam is is it uh, is it a cat what what are you what is it besides it having a supercomputer brain which is terrifying on yard just be blue and we can end this madness eh, I don't know <laughs> is it cat is it dog Oh, Ponyard. I think I have more of a problem with the name than the mustache. Would have been cooler if they made an entirely, entirely different female form. What, for King Gambit? What, you don't like the name of King Gambit? Well, I have a female Slow King that I've just renamed to Slow Queen, but Slow Queen does not have a mustache. What are you doing, gifting subs? Thank you so much. You didn't have to do that. Flomac, you just got a gifted sub. Enjoy your emotes, my friend. I watch Flo while I'm working. He was shiny hunting for Arbor Day. Did you end up getting anything? Yeah, if it didn't have a mustache, I would just rename it to Queen Gambit, but it has a crazy rowdy mustache. So that's why I didn't do that. On yard, just be blue, bro. They all look blue is the problem. Maybe they're all shiny. Only got five minutes. Five minutes to get this shiny. Don't, don't, this, this can't, no, this can't happen. Don't be elusive now. Come on. It's the second time we've hunted you. And you're going to be fucking stubborn like this when a whole bunch of y'all spawn here. There's no way. There's no way. And you're like super annoying to hunt because you all look blue.
What's going on over there? On yard. Just be blue, please. Please. Oh my god, I thought that one was blue so hard. What the hell? They're all blue. The smaller they are, it's the worst. Oh my god, I only got two minutes. Come on, come on. Be cool to have a shiny big Roth. Just be blue. You see how many of you are spawning? It's insane that not one, no shiny. Dude, this Pokemon like refuses to be shiny. So fuck you. Dude. Every time I'm like, oh that one's shiny for sure. Nope. Nope. My eyes are playing tricks on me. More news at 12. Speed. I am speed. Come on. Come on. No. No. Damn. Can't believe that entire time. Not one. Not one. I don't know where a sand dial falls. 
Oh, we got one. Gen 5 is the first Pokedex entry. Wow, it really is before everything. That's crazy. Wow. I don't know why this is an open slot once again. All right. I believe that is cute. Scoot. It's good. Let's see here. All right. Let's go say hi to Crazy Cowboy here. I didn't know when he started streaming, but I guess he did. But thanks for showing up, everybody, for hanging out. Everybody go say hi. I'll be back on Thursday. And uh, yeah, it's been a good time. We did all kinds of random crazy shit today, including pavilion stuff. I'll let you know how that goes. But uh, I don't know what he's playing. Some type of Pokemon game, but I will catch you all next time. See you later.